stay back. You okay? Huh? Yeah, thanks. <sighs> Guess they were too much for me. I'm just gonna have to train harder. You're pretty tough. It really handled those things. Are you here to enter the games? What games? The games games. To see who's strongest. One day, I'm gonna win them all and become a true hero. Hank! Where are you? Front and center right now, or I'm tacking on another thousand laps. Uh-oh. Gotta go. The Coliseum's just up ahead. I, I hope I get to see you fight there sometime! A competition. Hmm. I should find out how strong I really am. Louise, one chump after another. It's like a who's who of Decathlon disasters around here. All I need is one measly warrior tough enough to give Zeus a jolt of his own medicine. Wait. Dark, moody, powerful? Yes, he's perfect. This is it. How sad is this? Huh? Mm, pains me to see it. All that power going to waste. Who are you? Name is Hades, Lord of the Dead, God of the Underworld, yada yada, how you doing? Hey, let me guess. You're trying to put the kibosh on the darkness inside you. Am I right? Of course I'm right. Well, anyway, bad idea. Wait, what? Okay, stay with me. Darkness is inside everybody. Nothing to be ashamed of. You play nice with it, and darkness will be your best friend. But if you go and get all self-conscious and refuse to face it, the darkness will run over you like a debutante at a toga sale. And then where are you? Nowhere. Now me, I look at you, and I see potential. That's right, kid. You got the potential to conquer the darkness inside you. And I'll even give you some pointers. I mean, believe me, if anybody knows conquering, I know conquering. Well, let's hear it then. How do I conquer the darkness? Easy. You sign up for the games. I know, I know. Please, Lord Hades, the games. But hey, you would be surprised what you can learn in the heat of battle. And don't worry, I'll be right there to guide you every step of the way. I'm kind of what you'd call an expert in the art of darkness. Oh, decide fast. This is a limited time offer. When are you going to tell me how to conquer the darkness? Hold your chariot horses. You would 
not believe the bureaucracy involved with these things. Name? Terra. Kind of earthy, but all right. Now, height and weight. What's this? Favorite god? <laughs> Come on, Hades. There, ba boom. Easy peasy. I sense that you're already starting to get all warm and fuzzy with that darkness inside you. It's sweet, really. And hey, by the time you win the final match here, you'll have figured out how to conquer it for good. And don't worry, anything goes wrong, I'll make it all go away. Service with a smile. I got it.
Okay, this is not what I had in mind. Ah, uh, but hey, I can improvise. Time for Plan Beta. Pardon me, coming through. I'm gonna miss my match. Hello, Plan Beta. Hey, kid! Huh? Over here. Come here. Once I've conquered the darkness in my heart, I'll never have to fear it again. Super Warrior, see, right here, this, it's the power of darkness, could have been yours, still could, if you open up to it. Hades, you were just playing me. The darkness will never have me. Help me. You've got to set my heart free. It looks like I bet on the wrong dark horse. That kid doesn't have what it takes to handle darkness. You gonna make it? Yeah. Yeah. I'm finally free. Where is... He's gone. Man, how could I let a guy like him control me? I'll never live it down. <laughs> Thanks. Um... Tara. 
Thanks, Terra. I'm Zack. Hmm. Yep. Definitely. Terra, you're exactly what I pictured a hero would be. Not the way you look. There's something else about you. Well, I'm no hero. Trust me. Are you kidding? Listen to those cheers, man. You don't get to decide if you're a hero or not. They do. And they've already made up their mind. Whether you like it or not, you're their hero. <laughs> and mine, too. It's too bad. I really wanted to fight you fair and square. Maybe someday, Zack. <laughs> Is he the one? Yes, Grand Councilwoman. I've confined him until we can determine what he is. Take cover! Leave it to me to handle these fiends. Whatever you are, you're under arrest! Eventually. Unversed. I'll give you a fight.
Very impressive display. Wait! You help! I have been imprisoned on ridiculous charges. Is that so? I am an innocent scientist who created galaxy's most destructive, <laughs> constructive species of all time. Why my experiment could annihilate creatures you fought so hard. He is bulletproof, fireproof, and can think faster than supercomputer. He can see in the dark and move objects 3,000 times his rather diminutive size. And for reasons preposterous, the Federation Council fears him. They take him away from me and throw me here in small, stuffy, rather badly lit cell. Because he's so powerful? Exactly. Everyone always gets antsy and pantses when somebody more powerful is in the neighborhood. You understand, perhaps? We must make to rescue him or he'll be banished to far reaches of space. Okay then. Take me to him. Experiment 626. His name I give to adorable fluffy creature you're helping for to rescue. And I am genius scientist who created him, Dr. Jumbo Jukiba. I'm Terra. Pleasure is all ours. 626 is this way. Hurry!
Is it not such tremendous power in such itty bitty package? Truly, he's the one and that's the only. The mightiest creature in all of galaxy. And his only singular instinct to destroy everything he touches. See? What? When did you... give that back? Ulid is already marked for destruction. No, stop! My friend gave me that! <laughs> oh. Friend? Are you joking? <laughs> Such concept is totally lost on 626. <laughs> funny. This whole time I've been telling myself I want to be stronger, more independent. But the second I let my heart do the talking, I find out how little I really know myself, and how much I miss them. That experiment of yours, you sure about him? Maybe in his heart he wants friends, just like the rest of us. Impossible, Petty! He has no actual feelings, only destructive instincts I have carefully chosen for him. Or perhaps you need another demonstration of my evil geniusness. <laughs> <laughs> 